Yes, it's T's representing for the Three Pointers TV Arsenal fan view. Um, so we just had we were just escorted out of the stadium. We got kicked out. Stadium. We got kicked out. We got kicked out. Mate. We got kicked out. Right in a minute, honey. honey. Put no way, she's still here. She's still with us. You know what I mean? We're gonna win the league, aren't we? We're gonna win the league. All right. Sorry. Um, so Marty, man, what I wanted to ask you, mate, is um, were you happy with the um, substitutions tonight? I don't know. Look, I don't know why you brought Tommy Asu on for Ben White. I don't know why. Like that is just personally. Look, I'm not obviously. Mikel Arteta does a fantastic job of managing the club, and who am I to say? But personally, I, I just wouldn't have brought him on. It's, you know, we were fine at the back, and I would have. I would have personally liked to have seen Fabio Vieira or Marquinhos, one of those boys, get a run, run out and see what they're about. Yeah. You know, and, and I think it was a, a, an opportunity to get them out, but maybe saving them from a, for another situation. I mean, I don't want to say anything too too derogatory about Mikel Arteta because I think he's doing an absolutely fantastic job. Uh, one thing I love is I sit right by him and I see how animated he is, and he's up and he's out and his arms in the air and he's jumping around. And I think uh, you know that's something we've been missing for so long in a manager. Someone's enthusiastic as hell, someone that's sharp as a tack, and someone that just absolutely wants to go for it and is behind the, behind the team and infuses them and, and, and gives them that, that, that electricity to, to move forward. Yeah. Eddie, Eddie came on, he made a bit of an impact though, didn't he? They're all singing, singing his name and everything. Yeah, do you know what? The thing I loved about Ed, Ed, Eddie, Eddie Enketia was Enke. game management. He'd give the boy the ball and it reminds me of John Barnes in 88-89 80, <laughs> season when he should have just took it to the corner flag and then obviously the ball got passed back, was it Winterburn, off to Lukage and we, know, <laughs> we all know the rest of Mickey Thomas sticks it in the back of the net. <laughs> but, you know, Eddie started running it down the right flank, he'd get to the corner flag, he'd stop, you know, it, it, game management, that's one thing as well that Arsenal, this Arsenal team and this season that I've seen fantastically is game management and game control. And that is how Real Madrid won the Champions League last year. You know, if you look up against City, they were 2-0 down, they got two lucky goals. Then when they got the third, they were, I mean, Courtois was throwing a ball into the crowd and the, the games they were playing were absolutely unbelievable. Obviously, watching that against... There we go, the old Tottenham lot. So, uh, so you know, watching that is frustrating as hell. But the bottom line is, it wins you championships. It wins. Yeah. It, it won your um, Real Madrid the Champions League. You know, for God's sake. So, yeah. you know, they're valid tactics, and you know, you need to do them and play within the rules. And you know, see the game out. When you're two one up, what's the point in trying to go for to make three one just to get your name on the score sheet when you can close it off? And I think that's the difference again. Why we're five out of five is because in the last few seasons, the last load of seasons, we haven't had game management. That's where that old classic one nil to the Arsenal comes. We'd score a goal and we'd park the bus for the rest of the game. Yeah. And George Grant, and that won us. That won us league titles. That won us, you know, FA Cups. And it does. And that's that's the that's the truth in Tottenham. I think West Ham nearly scored. I think West, I think West Ham nearly scored. It's, I think it's still remaining 1-1. One, one. It's 1-1 one, one at the moment. One, one at the into moment. stoppage time, I'm guessing now. Yeah, so it's, hopefully, it's, uh, it's, if that result uh, stays well, as it the, is, the, the, the game should be, be finished in the second. That's going to be a great result for, for yeah, Arsenal, Yeah, of course. It? Look, we're gaining points. They've, they've just dropped two points and we've just gained three. Um, so again, we're, we're moving places higher than a lot of these teams. Chelsea losing to Saints last night, 2-1. What a great result again. I mean, I, I seriously can see Chelsea finishing 6th yeah. or 7th this season. They've bought a load of players. Like, and they look good players on paper, but they, they've just gone out and walloped yeah. a load of dough and a load of players. And are they going to play well together? On the, on the early showings against Leeds and Southampton. Now, if you're going to be challenging near the top, I'm sorry, you need to be beating Leeds and you need to be beating Southampton. <laughs> Leeds beat uh, relegation by an absolute whisker yeah. like last season. And that's the truth of it, yeah. you know? Uh, so... You know they've got to be beaten and, and to get beaten three 0 if, if this Arsenal team now is getting, there you go. There's the final. Right, result. that's the if, final if, whistle. If, if, if this, West Ham, West Ham one, Tottenham one. If this if this Arsenal team was getting beaten three 0 by Leeds or two one by Saints, and those are the results we were getting last season, there'd be an absolute uproar. But we're not. We're five out of five. We're going strong. We move on to United. If we can do a number on them at Old Trafford and go away three points, then we've got Everton the following week, which you'd love to say another three points. This is some serious streak that we've got going on. You know? Listen, Marty, again, you've been absolutely brilliant, Marty. Thank, Thank you, you so Thank much. You. Thank you so much. Well. Yeah, of course. Yeah, I was going to come to the honey. camera, little honey. Come yeah. on. Big up, honey, man. She loves her football. Come on, you guys. Come, come on. Come on. Listen, man. Thank you so much for coming back on the Pleasure, mate. Thanks you know, the, the Three Pointers TV. Um, we'll see you guys on the next one. Um, big up Dubs, uh, shout out to Stapes, um, big up my man Io, uh, Aiden, 
And uh, listen, man, don't forget, like, share, and subscribe. Yeah? Can you tell, tell, the pe tell the people what they should do, honey? Like, share, and subscribe. Like, share, and subscribe. And we got the Three Pointers TV. The and, three... and be on the Three Pointers TV. Nice yes. one. Come on, come on, you Come on. Guys. Come on. Come on, peeps. What are you waiting for? Like, share, subscribe to the Three Pointers.